Hello guys and welcome back for another video with Paul Family. I'm Daniel. I'm Natalia. And uh, we are back with another video from Best Ever Food Review Show. We've done one or two videos a couple of months ago. He's the guy mm -hmm. that... Uh, I forgot his name. Tried the, the rats. The rats. The bat. No. Bats or rats? rats? What did he try? Rats and uh, the Javanese uh, belly pork in the... Yeah, 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 yeah. Javanese? Mm -hmm. Do I don't remember? know what was what. I remember they put like in something... That was... Uh, bamboo. No uh, yeah. So this is uh, Jakarta street food tour. God level martabak, mm. which we made and tried. If you want to check it, it's in uh, on Natalia's channel. Okay. And uh, Jakarta best street food. Uh, very curious. Uh, I think that you break the Ramadan already. Till this video is gonna be uploaded because it's with food. <laughs> and. Uh, we don't want to cause any more, uh, <laughs> like, you know. Problems with the food, like to be hungry. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I believe that it's going to be quite late evening. But yeah, let's check this video out. Uh, again, I forgot who sent it. Uh, I need to start making those screenshots. I'm very sorry, uh, you're gonna see the video and uh, hope that you're gonna enjoy it. You're gonna it. know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, don't don't forget, forget, if you're new and enjoying watching these videos with us, subscribe, like, hit the notification bell to stay up to date to know when we're gonna post our next videos. Don't forget to check the original video from Best Ever Food Review Show. You can find it in the description. Uh, I'm curious what kind of food, street food special. Because Martabag, you know, God level. Oh, okay, let's, let's see. see. Ready, steady. Mm -hmm. Wait, might be on speakers. Yes. Go. People really appreciate when you show them the inside of foods, but I can never show people the inside. What's that? Out of my heart. Martabag. Uh, mm. No? That, that. From his... This is my first foodie mission into Indonesia. We've arrived in Jakarta, Indonesia's capital, to hunt down the best and most unique food this sprawling metropolis has to offer. That's bakso? Yeah, but it's in like in bread, I don't know. It's hard to pin down a singular culinary identity here. Over the vast amount of ethnic groups and cultures that make up Indonesia, there's huge variations in traditions, food availability, and local taste preferences. We've got uh, what was that? here cooking in coconut milk. I cannot wait to try this out. With such overwhelming culinary possibilities, I'm gonna make it easy well, by starting here. Those were bots. Bots? Yes. Okay, um. There's huge variations in traditions, food availability, and local taste yeah. preferences. We've got five fresh bats in here cooking in coconut milk. I cannot wait to try this out. With such overwhelming culinary possibilities, oh, oh, oh. I'm going to make it easy by starting here. Sabang Street Food Market. From 6 p.m. to midnight, so street I am. spring up, tossing together some of the best flavors of Jakarta. It's cheap, it's more like bar. That's not Joining me this evening, Rachel. She grew up in Jakarta, but moved to Texas when she was 13. Now she's back for a taste of her childhood. When you're not here, do you ever miss these flavors? Yes, I do. That's why I made my own. It's not as good as this, but I can make it. She'll help me navigate Sabang Market as we sample everything. <laughs> From some not so common poultry. This is kind of like a roadrunner leg almost. To street food made with that was a massive oh, like leg, chicken leg. Mm -hmm. ready to send this letter to the president. And the most indulgent dessert I have ever witnessed. Anything in life that makes you feel that good is bad for you. But first, we're starting with the staple of Indonesian street food. That yeah, looks nice. Is that true? Everything that makes you feel better is it bad for you? So basically, mm -hmm. everything that makes you happy. It's bad for you. It's bad for you. Not yeah. quite. 
every few I months. like to like uh, to watch uh, movies and it's bad for me, no? <laughs> yeah, you're you wasting, said that. You're wasting your time. Always. Yeah. So see, it's true. <laughs> I like go fishing. But it's not so you're that. wasting your time. No, it's not. Yes. That uh, that uh, it's the space and uh, small breaks so where I can uh, wasting. Uh, you know, instead of doing yoga or things like those, I'm going fishing and uh, everything's you know calm down, relaxing, uh, refilling my batteries. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like crazy fried rice. Yeah. Gila. It's crazy. What is that one? Quick yao, it's like that thick noodles. And bihun is permissly. Here they also have the crazy migraine. The gila crazy usually gila they crazy. put a bunch of spices in there. So it's gonna be like spicy. Are you sure we should start with that? It's not gonna yeah, be spicy yeah. only. It's gonna be it's crazy, it's like spicy, so crazy. Crazy as spicy. <laughs> oil, sausage, meatballs, eggs, cabbage, bok choy, then our noodles. Chicken, okay. seasonings, sambal, Looks nice. shrimp paste, and soy sauce. All stir fried on high heat until we have this. A gorgeous nice. pile of Jakarta's favorite street food. Add in some pickle and their ubiquitous crackers. Looks nice, like color and Our everything. Crazy spicy fried rice gets all the same ingredients, swapping noodles for rice. And of course, the crackers are mandatory. I will prefer the rice, you no, know the noodles. That's there. a good point. Here, they always have this on the side, right? The purupo. Yep. Purupo. Do you ever do it like nachos <laughs> in there? Like nacho it up? Can I do that? Okay, yeah. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Very satisfying. It seems like all the flavors are there. It's yep. spicy, salty, savory. Not that spicy, but it's really good. It feels like Indonesian comfort uh, food. Indonesian people love rice. They can cook anything. Love rice, love spicy food. food. Is it okay if we switch? Yeah. Okay, so we have the special noodles here. Mm. Mm. I love this one. I like this even more. That texture of the egg noodle is so chewy, oily, like it leaves yeah. your lips still oily. What do you call this kind of... <coughs> that one oh, spicy. spicy. Oh, your voice changed. Uh -huh. That's my Batman spicy voice. What do you call this kind of street side restaurant here? A dai, it's just like warung on the side of the road. Usually the family, friends, they come in here. There's a bunch of food up and down this street. Is there anything you're looking forward to showing me? I saw burung goreng, fried bird. I ate it when I was a kid. Fried what? It was really good. Bird. Yeah. We're going to go on a whole food adventure tonight. I hope you're hungry. I am super hungry. Let's do this. But first we should eat this, right? Nah. Finish. Fried bird, and you are not lying. It is right fried here bird. before us. What kind of bird is this? It's a grouse. When's the last time you even heard of grouse? Maybe like in an animal book when they got to G and they didn't know what else to put. So we've got some breast, yeah. wing. But look how long this yeah. leg is. It's much longer and thinner than a chicken leg. Why don't we get a little bit of everything? Hello, sir. One order of. Grouse, we need to please. look out for it. See. Man, that is bubbling hot. Look at that. 10 pieces like for 50. That. We got a special discount. It's three and a half bucks. Let's go enjoy this. Thank you. Kadima Kasi. So here is that long grouse leg I was talking about. And like this is kind of like a road runner leg almost. It's cooled down. We did let it hang out for about five minutes to cool down. And maybe we let it hang out too much. Because it's fairly Getting tough. Hard. I'm gonna try to bust it off right off the bone. Cheers. Cheers. I think it's very <laughs> it's a very firm meat. There's like yep. plenty of oil on my hands, but the meat itself is, is still not fatty. This one is just some skin on a bone. You love the skin, right? Yeah, I do. Mmm, springy. It's very crispy, though. No gaminess at all. That's very not, lean yeah. animal. And I think this one in particular was on a diet before it got here. <laughs> This is a famous satay I always hear about. Have you tried the chicken skin? No. Over here, they also have a chicken yolk egg. Is that an unlaid egg? It's like a chicken uh, egg, but it's only the yolk. Let's get that. I've never seen that. Here. I like this it. is my favorite, the chicken skin. And I didn't know that was no. really a possibility. They're gonna do oh, it. why, yeah. why, 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 why? To make the... They don't use fans here. They are doing it the traditional way, always. Oh, wow. I think the fan mm -hmm. is a much better idea if I'm honest. Thank you, okay, sir. Okay, there you go. The 
bowl just has a huge peanut amount sauce. of peanut sauce in it. Let's grab the skin first. That's your favorite one. Here we go. Mmm, I love it. Yeah, it's very fatty. All the flavor is coming from that peanut sauce. We're grabbing this chicken one. Here we go. These the colors and everything. Mm, very good. A little heavier, but still tender enough. Really How looks many nice. What would you eat if you came here for a snack? I usually order 20 pieces. But the skin, though. That's awesome. Right here, they slapped a big egg on the bottom of that saute. So you gotta work your way to the egg yolk. Mmm. Oh, it's so soft. I like the skin a lot. And egg yolk. Mm. Mm. So smoky. That's delicious. It's meat on a stick. What else could you ask for? Maybe just some live music. <laughs> Do -do -do. What's that? An envelope. Here they have Martabak. Martabak telor. Martabak telor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I did it on accident. Nice. This is kind of like an Indonesian crepe almost. Yeah, the regular one is only two eggs. Special is like three eggs. Istimewa is above the special. He's gonna use five eggs. Oh, that's too many eggs, actually. It's like a bodybuilder can get that one. We'll just get the special. So first he cracks an egg. Another egg. We've seen the colors of the eggs. Beef, we've got scallions, and now he's mixing it all together. Beef. And then now this is where it gets fun. Oh, Skills. So he's gonna take this tiny piece and make Whoa. it into this huge thin layer. Throws it onto the tawa and puts in the filling. So we've got the egg, beef, yeah, scallions, everything, everything in there. Folding it up like an envelope. That's like an omelette bar. Yeah. This is some heavy. That's different. Food, man. How does he know when Obviously, it's Obviously, it's heavy. It's still not yet done. And then when it feels light, that's when it was it's light. It, in it got yes. light. From here, it cuts it into about eight different pieces. That is crazy. Steamy that has to be good. We're gonna have to wait a few minutes for that to cool down. Now get ready for the heavy most indulgent. Dessert ah. you have ever laid eyes on. This is like the sweet version compared to the other one. It starts innocent enough with some simple batter left to bake in this mold for a few minutes. Then comes the sugar. Once a strategy, At least we know the taste of this. Yeah, the it's so the good. Might, might be different a bit. But a dessert, definitely. But the mounds of chocolate will bring you back. Then plenty of sweet, sugary, condensed milk. Already, this seems that's a lot. Yeah, I didn't put that much, and still was very sweet. Add even more margarine and slice it up, and that is how you make the most simple dessert in Jakarta. And it's good. First of all, with the egg, we waited the perfect amount of time. It is still warm. We've got all those. So this is Marta Bak, but it's the other. Look at that slow motion. No, it's not Marta Bak. Sorry. They said that they they have Marta Bak sweet, and another different Marta Bak. But it's not this one. No, this no, is the... Yeah, that's the, that one that we said with omelet, yeah. Wow. People really appreciate when you show them the inside of foods. But I can never show people the inside of my heart. Uh, I don't think I want to know. So do we dip it in the uh -huh. try it out. <laughs> that is delicious. Perfect egg ratio. It's with the sauce? You can try some durian. It's just behind you. Very bouncy. What is it? It's like a toaster strudel, it. but with egg in the middle. Mm. Love that. We oh, yeah. Extra fluffy. Mark the back. Oh, wow. You should try it. It is so soaked. You're going to eat it eat like it that? The whole thing? Okay, let's do it. Whoa. It's really good, but that it is, is heavy. It is heavy. That is an oily, It is. Mess. Whoa, that's a lot, isn't it? It's like a cake. Like, it, this has this from the it. And you can still see milk. on the top. Is that cheese or butter? From, from the butter. Margarine. Okay. Margarine. Really from the margarine. Bottom layer. It's a lot. Oh. That's so good. But it's so unhealthy. It's so unhealthy. Look at this. I can wring out the margarine. But it's oh, like that's a lot. Oh, so my God. Right okay. Mm. Anything in life that makes you feel that good is bad for you. It's just over the top delectable. Damn. Can you say it three times fast? I think we can make a song like Pempe Palembang. Pempe Palembang. Pempe Palembang. That sounds really cool. What does it mean actually? It's like a mackerel fish with the egg inside. Mackerel fish. Boil it and then they fry it. I've never seen something like that before. And then this one is the skin of the fish. I want to get that the one? egg one and the I want to get one? the skin one. How long does he fry it? About five minutes. So we got three crunchy fried fish skin. There's that's the long the, one. Yeah, that's the nothing. And we're so just going to mix these all together. A little bit of vinegar, and that is food. Ooh. Let's eat it. That's a lot of vinegar. Oh, 
I was wondering, what is so fishy here? It's that prawn powder. It's like pure oceanic smells going right to the back of my skull. I want to try this piece here right away. It's really just like soaking in Is that the, the, the yeah, is vinegar? Cakey. Let's go for it. That's a lot. Mmm. You love it? Yeah. Hi there. How did you know I needed a tissue? What's your name? Bianca. Bianca. Oh. What's your name? What did you say? <laughs> One is 5,000, so you should buy two. How about you keep your inventory? <laughs> she left. She was like, thanks for the extra money. I'm done. I get to go to sleep now. I'm just going to wash it in that vinegar. So delicious. Classic. But what, what type of vinegar is? It so depends on the what vinegar it is. I want to try the fish skin one. Ready? Yeah, the vinegar so is more. really strong. It's definitely more fatty. I love the egg one. I love my new tissues. That little girl is adorable, and I hope she grows up to be a CEO. Yeah, a CEO. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> Sugar. This one is the cow skin. It's rehydrated. The, the thing is, it's just the colors. What? What was that? Look at those colors. The chilies. Are these malted milk balls? This is actually egg marinated with palm sugar. This so egg marinated no, this with one. palm know. sugar. This one is the cow skin. It's rehydrated. Palm skin. Palm skin. Palm skin. I believe. Cow skin. And this one is the unripe jackfruit. And it's completely brown. Yes, because they fermenting for two days. I've never seen any of these things before. What's the meal called? Guduk. Guduk. One guduk? <laughs> mm. First, they're going to put on a big pile of rice. Oh. And then this brown jackfruit. Be honest, I wouldn't eat this. An egg. What? This sauce no. goes on the jackfruit. What kind of sauce is that? This is not for me. Oh, I don't like how it looks. The circle of foodie life here with some sambal. That is it. <laughs> I don't like how it looks. Is there a <gasps> you can try. Yeah, I can try, but not Certain buy it for me. I will not eat it. Effectively. What do you mean by unripe? Like it just wasn't ripe yet? Yeah, and then they... So that's the jackfruit. jackfruit. Left Never it tried. for two days to... F to Ferment. Or how you saying? Okay. Ferment, absorb, I don't know. Too. Let's go for it. <laughs> that is out there. Caramelized, sweet, still salty. It's like a sweet mashed potatoes and gravy. Let's work up to the cow skin. I want to cut this egg in So half. it's Start cow outside, skin, not palm skin. Inside. Let's go for it. Well, it's a lot like a normal egg. <laughs> a little bit of palm fragrance on the outside. Otherwise, very eggy. The last one here, such a treat. It was dried cow rinds that have been rehydrated. It looks like very jelly. Jelly, yeah. Light. It's been doused with some different seasonings. Let's just go for it. Ooh. What? It's like a sponge that exploded in my mouth. It's full of chili oil. It's a little overwhelming, but not too bad. Chili oil? You like it? Yeah, I like it. Okay, well, I saved the last one for you. Well, in this video... <laughs> I saved the last one for you. He doesn't like it. <laughs> in this video, we've seen... We've been seeing a lot of videos with food in Indonesia, Jakarta. Yeah, Bali, but these Ubud. are new. These... I believe that there are thousands yeah, of... of uh, types of food, food like yeah. street food and everything. Well, I'm kind of eh? There you go. Oh, she did it for real. <laughs> <laughs> he was Rachel, thinking that she's not going to so do it. Thank you so much for joining me today. Checking out all these awesome street foods here in Jakarta, Indonesia. So many new Indonesian wonders that hit my tongue. That was a lot pleasure. of new. Yeah. And for you guys, this video was made possible by One Trip Vietnam. One Trip is the highest rated tour company in Vietnam doing tours from north to south. Right now in Hanoi, Da Nang, Hoi An, and Saigon, you can experience food tours, adventure tours, and more. To learn Vietnam. more about trip, check out the links in the description down below. I will see you next time. A Peace. You want to eat one of these? Sure. You pay. <laughs> good, good girl. So this was Jakarta Street Food Tour. Uh, good level Martabak. God level. Good level. God level. God level Martabak and Jakarta best street food. Like I said we've seen loads of videos from Indonesia regarding foods or with foods, uh, different types of, uh, I don't know, menus, street food, normal food, home yeah. cooked food. Sweet and uh, salty. Wow, in this one, we've seen loads of new ones. That Never bird thought. as well, no? Yeah, we, we have ever to seen look. it. We have to look. No, Never check seen out. It. 
Uh, very, very, very nice video. <laughs> and she was funny as well. Yeah. Uh, I'm curious if you tried Dudian. What he thinks. I think that he tried it before. Yeah, definitely. He has loads of videos. But uh, anyway, we really, really enjoyed it. So thank you very much for send us this recommendation. <laughs> thank you, best ever for the review My mistake. show. Don't forget if you are new and enjoying watching these videos with us, subscribe, like hit the notification bell to stay up to date to know when we're gonna post our next videos. Don't forget to check the original video from Best Ever Food Review Show. You can find it in the description. Stay safe, take, take care. care and see you soon. See you in the next one. Bye. Bye.